Wait, what the hell? Is that a rock drake? What? Oh! No! What the? Oh my god, that's not a rock drake! So today's the day I'm finally gonna get myself one of those rideable Kentros, and we also have Kibble now! I'm so excited for this. Like, the fact that we've actually kind of gotten to this point is really great, because I absolutely hate taming up herbivores with crops or berries or whatever the hell we have. Now we have lots and lots of kibble, and these things actually take regular kibble. Well, I mean, the regular Kentros do, so I'm just gonna assume that these ones do as well. I couldn't see anything on the mod page from a quick glance, but hopefully I'm not wrong here. Uh, we also have this amazing Kentro saddle. Well, it's not that amazing, but I mean, it's, it's decent. It's 50 armor. We have this Kentro saddle that we got in the last episode uh, from that Alpha Carno, so obviously we have that to use for this dude. We just need to find a good one, and uh, yeah, you know what? If I'm teaming up something like this, I want want to at least be finding a 174 or 180 so we've already seen a 174 before i couldn't spot it there yesterday but i think i might just check around the area over here and just see if we can manage to find some more of these dudes like it would probably be better to tame one in this area instead of where we were in the death episode a couple episodes ago what is that a stego i think it might be uh yeah that's a stego is that another stego no that is a parasaur i cannot tell from this distance really unless i like focus my eyes on it all right, well, anyway, yeah, um, we're going to be taking a little look around for these dudes. Actually, also, I, let me show you something real quick. I, uh, I went out and about, and I actually managed to find a nice saddle for my Carno. Let's see. Let me just, just chuck you down. You can see right there, 73 armor. Not bad at all. Definitely will be helping. I almost took fall damage there. <laughs> it's definitely going to be helping out my dude uh, to try and survive a little bit easier. But um, you know what? Like this, this guy's already pretty beefy. He's already pretty powerful. You know, like that's definitely going to give us that little bit of extra edge that I needed. So um, yeah, I have seen these dudes around the, the swampy kind of area. So I think I'll just check in here. We're definitely loading something in. I can always tell. There's actually something over here. I don't think I've seen this before. Have I? Uh, let's see. Maybe treasure. Just a really strange statue with a, uh, a Rex head as the, the head of the statue. Cool. What else do we have in here? Nothing? I think that's about it. There might be treasure here somewhere, but I don't I don't see any like spots where the, it would be. All right, well, it's okay. Let's see. Uh, Jim wants to talk to me one sec. Okay. Hey, dude. One new Tyrannus saddle. See, this is this is an advantage of having like good tribe mates. Hold on, I need some, I need some meat. Hey, uh, I, oh, I, yeah. never, I never said I was going to craft it for free. <laughs> All right. No, no, no. It's a fair exchange. Take off your pants. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, right. There we go. Well, there you go. I thought you you'd appreciate that. What is this? Oh. <laughs> you don't be. <laughs> yeah, you've got, to, you've got to tame one now. <laughs> got to tame a super OP one. <laughs> yeah. I think, we, I think we have a couple in here, actually. What? We, yeah, saddles? yeah, yeah. We have an even better one in here. Look at that. 164. Oh, what? Yeah. <laughs> you know what? The more uh, the merrier. <laughs> well, oh, there's another one as well. Well, not another one, but there's a, a mammoth saddle. Oh, you've got even one there. Yeah, you've I got, got that today, there. actually. That uh, mammoth saddle. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to a few drops. Yeah, uh, I, I keep some, finding them today, actually. Uh, blueprints as well. I got some... Uh, okay. Right, where's, where's the cupboard? It's right here. Oh, wait. Right, so I got a... Uh, where are we? Oh, a hat. Uh, oh, is that the fur cap? Yep. Nice. Uh, an ascendant mining drill. Oh, oh, that is so expensive. I'm not making that. Holy, <laughs> oh my god, it's seventeen thousand metal, like five thousand polymer. What the hell? <laughs> yeah. You can only craft uh, one. And uh, what else have we got? A uh, um, kite armor. Nice. Uh, what is that one? Oh, Apache saddle. Wait. Uh, oh, these are good. Uh, I might craft some of these now. Uh, Ascendant to de uh, desert gloves. Ooh, yeah. Fair gloves. Okay. Uh, All right. And, and uh, well, that's just a, a crappy hatchet. Oh, and a wooden shield. There you go. Nice. <laughs> yeah, I've uh, I I earlier on I came through here. I just like I chucked out all like the duplicate kind of ones. So if we had like a a worse one of something else. I just got rid of it. So yeah, I'll just, yeah, yeah. Uh, I, I think that's I'll what chuck that do. on the ground. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Uh, all right. Well, I guess I kind of want some of these gloves, to be honest. Yeah, yeah. I was. I'm gonna. Uh, I'm gonna here. craft some as well. Cause like, uh, I'm gonna drink here. some potion. Uh, do you want me to do it? I'm higher level. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god. Wow. I'm uh, much higher than you. 
<laughs> yeah, that's what I mean. That's why right. I wanted you to craft me a UT saddle. Oh, nice. Yeah. Because took... you grinded away. <laughs> <laughs> Here, took me the. Uh, did, did you get a potion? Yeah. Uh, oh, oh, wait. Oh, sorry. I thought you grabbed one. Um, oh, we need a little bit of silk. I'll uh, hop down below and grab that. Ooh, oh, it sounds like sounds Godzilla. Spooky. It does actually sound really scary. It does, doesn't it? Yeah, I love them actually. They look great. Like the extra like fur for the beard. Looks so good. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm kind of disappointed. Did you did you ever see that photo from a couple years ago just before the Uteranus got introduced? They had like a version of it where they like bloomed out its feathers a huge amount. Did you ever right, see that? Yeah. Oh, it's so funny yeah. looking. <laughs> it's just <laughs> like, like a this ball. Yeah, basically. It, was, it looks so ridiculous. It was great. <clears throat> Wonder how much of a buff it puts on. Uh, Probably the normal amount, I would say. Would you think? Yeah, I'd say so. Oh, you've got a buff as well. <laughs> it's buff. Oh, no, it's your parrot. Yeah, I yeah. thought, why have you got a buff? <laughs> it's because you got a parrot on your sword. That's Damn funny. it, Jack. All right, here we go. Look inside the smithy. Okay. Gonna craft how many? two of these gloves. One, two. Wow, oh. are you kidding me? <laughs> one of them came out <laughs> so much better than the other. I, I'll, right. I'll take that one. I'll uh, take the last okay, one. Okay, fair enough. Here's uh, here's yeah. your rifle. Boom. Oh, yeah. yeah. And... Wait, oh. Where is it? oh, you got a really good one. Wow. Dang it. Mine came out win. at uh, 13%. <laughs> <laughs> that felt yeah. good. I was thinking of getting think... another one when we have lots more metal. Yeah. Nice. Wow, right. look at that. Let me put on my fancy gloves. Yeah, yeah. Me too. Ooh, fancy. I don't want to play with you anymore. Old gloves. Yeah, let's get rid of the old stuff. All right. Now that I've helped out Jim, we are back on the search. Hopefully I can manage to actually find a freaking high level Kentro. That would be great. So far, I haven't actually even seen a single one, which is making me a little bit nervous. I think what I need to do is head over to the other side of the swamp area here. Look at these freaking birds, dude. I want one. They look so good. Oh man, my one looks okay, but not as good as these ones. And also my MOA now has just become the, you know, the the egg incubator essentially. So yeah, we uh, we actually need to tame like a proper one that I can use because I actually did like it. I think it's a pretty cool creature. Definitely would like a really, really fast version of it though. All right, well anyway, um, still kind of looking around anyway. I mean, like we're just probably gonna check around these little fields right around here. This is kind of close to, that's the entrance to the Aberration Cave, right? I think it might be. By the way, actually, we will be heading down there at some point because I've heard that there's a lot more to that cave and also probably rock drakes are down there as well, I would imagine. So, yeah, we, we've got lots of stuff to do down there at some point. What the hell is that? Are those like roots or something like hanging off the edge? What am I looking at here? Oh, I think it is. Okay. A little bit weird looking. Okay, great. I've kind of ended up in like the area that I didn't really want to be in. But you know what? I know that they spawn over here, so I guess I'm going to continue off in this direction. We'll see. We'll see what we can find. Uh, Karno is completely out of stamina, basically, so I think I'm just going to chill here for a bit. Oh, you know what? I took a little clip of something the other day. Let me go ahead and play that for you guys. Oh, I really hope this thing is still here. I managed to find a big boy salmon. Oh, I see it. Yeah, look at that monster. Holy crap. It's a 2.5. Definitely needed to go ahead and snag this thing. Um, yeah. Let me, let me go. Oh, whoa. Why is it freaking out? Bro, please don't go out of the water. I'm I'm actually going to cry. Please don't. Please don't kill yourself. It's not worth it. No, life is worth living. I'll feed you to a shadow main if they're on this map. I think they might be. Not 100% certain about that. Oh my god, look at the size of that thing. Okay, let's grab this. Let's grab the fish trap. We're using reusable uh, tent and reusable fish trap. Let's see. Let me just... I don't even know. Is this even going to work? There we go. Okay, and then the fish trap. Boom. Okay, come on. Come on. Hey, gotcha. Oh, wait, what? Oh, that is no way. I didn't realize that's how the reusable fish traps worked. They just full on give you a fish trap every single time you do it. Wow, that's kind of insane. All right, well, I'm not going to keep this thing inside of a fish trap. I actually want to release it and then put it into a little uh, soul trap. So yeah, we can just store this thing until we eventually get ourselves a shadow main if they are on this map. Again, I'm pretty sure that they are, but not 100% certain. Okay, so I pissed off the beavers, but I actually just spotted another big salmon. It's a 2.2. Definitely need to get that one as well. I, again, I have no idea when we're going to make use of these fish, but eventually we will. So um, yeah, I don't know. It's definitely worth at least starting to look for fish now. Knowing how those fish trap things work, I'm really happy about that. That's kind of insane how easy that is. I, I figured that maybe I'd be able to just trap the fish and then you know once i release it i get this thing back 
you know, whereas you release the normal ones and it just, you know, you don't get that thing back. I just figured that's how it worked, but I guess not. You just full on get an infinite supply of them, which is kind of messed up. What are you? You're a 1.7. Where's the 2.2? There. Oh, yeah, that's it right there. Look at that thing. Holy crap. Uh, ooh, okay. Don't be. No, no, that's not even it. Wait, wait, wait. Where is it? Oh, that is that it? I gotta see. I think that might be it. No. Where did it go? Oh, no. I don't know where it went. I don't see it anymore. I didn't accidentally kill it somehow, did I? Oh, is this it? Oh, there you are. <laughs> oh, nice. Okay, let me go ahead and grab this thing as well. Boom, there we go. We got you. Let me go ahead and pick that up. Let me pick this up as well. I got to release this dude and then recatch him in this. And there we go. We got some oxygen. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, there we go. I I'm going to keep looking here. I mean, there, there could easily be a couple more fish. I think just in general, though, like I've showed you guys how I'm getting them. Um, when we eventually get to the point where we can find shadow mains, you know, if they are on this map, that's going to be really, really cool for us. We're just going to have like so many fish already if I prepare now. And hopefully we'll be able to get some really good shadow mains. What the hell? Does somebody take the cementing paste out of that thing and not, not break it? That's just cruel. Okay. We got some aloes here. I think I'm just going to run right through them. We'll just see if we can manage to find a Kentro. <laughs> just focus on that. Uh, yeah, I'd say around this area could be promising enough. Let's see. Oh, yeah. I see some stuff down here. That's totally a Kentro. Now, are they... Well, is it a good level? Who knows? It's a 168. Okay, it's pretty good. Hmm. I might get that. I don't know. I feel like I should probably hold out for a higher level, considering the fact that I have seen a, uh, a 180 or a 174 even. But, um, yeah, man, that looks dope, though. Look at that thing. I mean, like, it looks so similar to a Stego, except obviously a Stego is a little bit chubbier. Man, that looks awesome, though. I really like the colors and, like, the patterns and everything. I mean, like, regular Kentros are cool looking, but they're just, I don't know, they're just, like, tiny little mean Stegos, you know? <laughs> it's just not as cool as, you know, a giant version of it, which is rideable and, and you know, I don't know. It, it's like a fiercer kind of Stego, one that's a Stego made for battle instead of harvesting, you know? Although a lot of people use Stegos for, uh, for actual uh, battle as well. They're actually pretty good at that too. Oh, wow. This area up ahead of me here is beautiful. Look at that. That looks dope. I don't know. That's, I thought that this was all kind of the same part of this area here, but like that's kind of got like the greeny kind of yellowy grass. Whereas over here is just like a really vibrant kind of forest. Man, that looks dope. I don't know what's in this area though, to be honest. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if I really want to start exploring it at all, but um, yeah, that would be really, really cool to check out at some point. Going to continue on my mission, maybe back in this area, though, because I don't want to stray too far away from where I know is somewhat okay-ish. You know, I know there's wolves over here, but at least I know that they're there and that they could mess me up. But uh, I have no idea what's back there, but that looks dope. More aberration-y stuff here, I think. We got like really vibrant mushrooms. Oh, yeah, we got some gems there, too. Nice. Doesn't look like a cave entrance at all, but yeah, I guess we could just kind of find some of the stuff here. Oh, we got some more over here as well. It might be the same. I can see the gems, but yeah, it doesn't look like a cave entrance either. Oh, more Kentros. Hello. We got a 24 and an 18. All right. I reckon I should probably get in here and maybe try to help kill them just to kind of cull the herd. Oh, man. Okay. Yeah, they still have the recoil, don't they? Oof. All right. Come on. Come on, bro. They are terrifying looking, to be honest. Ooh, okay. Gotta watch out for that bleed. Sweet, we got him. We shot him up into the air and everything. All right, let's see. Any more around here? I guess this is kind of like the area to find them. Yeah, there's another one already. Okay, yeah. I think I'll just run around this spot here because, like, clearly this is the good spot to find them at. Oh, hello. 180 Kentro, and it's pretty nice looking, actually. We got another one here. What we'll level? uh 126 that one is much nicer looking wow i'm kind of annoyed that i'm getting these colors over those ones it's all good we got a really cool looking stego there as well i'll check him in just one sec there we go nice um how is that stego okay yeah terrible absolutely terrible beautiful looking though look at those colors damn dude all right sweet so um wait are these male and female let's see they are indeed. Oh, they have a pack bonus still as their big form. <gasps> oh, that's a little bit spicy. Okay. Um, I'm going to need to kill the little one. The little one. The lower level one. Um, yeah, we're going to need to do that real quick. All right. Maybe I'll just start out by like blasting it with the shotgun a little bit. And then we'll try and finish it off with the Carno before the other one gets over here. It doesn't look like it's coming at all. That's great. Sweet. All right. Let me see. 
So, yeah, I think I should be good to go here. Do I do I need to trap it? I don't really think so. In fact, you know what? I'm going to put you away. I'm going to take out Diego, and we're going to just ride on the back and just trank this thing. Hopefully, we should be okay. Or should I just trap it? I feel like I should trap it, because otherwise something bad's going to happen. I'm going to get a little upset, and, you know, we're going to lose this thing. So let me go ahead and quickly make up a little trap for this dude. Probably just like a two by two should do it, right? I mean, it might stick out a little bit, but we should be okay. I am floating. All right, well, I don't think the Kentra will be able to get over a wall, so I'm not going to attempt to build that any higher. We should be good to go here. Just need to lead it over. Also, I built an extra wall by accident. It's all good. Let's see, where best is this thing? There it is. All right, we'll probably just trank it a little bit as we bring it over. Don't really know what kind of torpor this thing's rocking, but you know what? Like, we, yeah, we'll just hit it a couple times. Come on, bro. Look at you. You are terrifying. Wow, okay. Ooh, dude, you, like, you're so far away from me. Why'd you think that was going to hit? That's not going to work. You need to be beside me to hit me with that. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, wow, he's already lost interest. A lot of, a lot of people are saying that the, uh, the losing interest super early is probably due to my parrot, and you might be right. I, I don't really know, to be honest. It could be. I mean, like, what does that actually say? I mean, it just kind of says that, like, when creatures, like, uh, get closer to you, they might not attack you. So, I don't know, man. It might kind of prevent it a little bit, but not a huge amount. I can't imagine that would probably stop things com from completely being aggroed to me. Let's see. Um, all right. This is kind of perfect. At this point, we're going to put you away. I'm going to go on foot, and I'll be able to just, like, run through the trap and lead him directly in. Where about he? There he is. Come on, bro. Get into my trap. All right. Uh, okay, now here's the issue. We got to get him trapped before he hits me or gets out. Uh, okay, we're good. <laughs> we got him. Sweet. All right. Let me go ahead and trank you out, bro. I wonder, can you get headshots on them? I don't even know. Probably not, I would imagine. I actually got to be a little bit cautious of him. Okay, well, I hit him in the head. It didn't count. I'm not going to try those anymore. Just because sometimes, you know, it's not that there isn't a hitbox there. Sometimes it might just be tricky to actually get uh, the game to realize that I did that. So, yeah, here we go. He is so angry. I'm so sorry. I got a nice saddle for you, though. We'll team you up. I'll give you so much nice kibble. Hey, got him. Okay, well, that actually didn't take too many hits. Let's see. Um, all right. Well, yeah, 6,000 Torpor. Let's see. So, it, I think it should be 15 kibble, I believe. But I'm not entirely sure, because obviously this is like a modded version. It might be slightly different. I'm really hoping that they still take the regular kibble, though. Let's see. Let me get you on the tracker. Are you... What the hell happened here? <laughs> Who's taming all these pegos? All right, let's see. Yeah, he's draining a little bit, but we're okay. Maybe what I'll do is I'll just quickly try to make up some spike fences around this area. I mean, I feel like we might be okay, but I still don't really want to risk it, though, because, like, this is a really good level. Hey, there we go. Nice. Oh, man. All right, let me go ahead and... Oh, you can ride them without a saddle? Oh, nice. All right, well, I guess we don't need to. Let's pop this on. There you go, buddy. All right, it kind of just goes around all the uh, the little plates and stuff. Let me just quickly pick up all these spikes. I might as well just bring some of this stuff home. I always end up just like dropping it because it's all too heavy. But we have some pretty good carry weight with this thing, actually. Let me go ahead and just get rid of that. Nice. Okay, man. A rideable Kentro. Oh, man. They are massive as well. Let me actually get right up against this uh, Steg over here. I just kind of want to see a proper size difference between them. Um, yeah, we got that guy. He's still over here. Kind of a little bit slow, um, not too fast at all, but you know what? It's, it's, it's not bad. It's not bad. Um, very, very chunky, actually. <laughs> they look really chunky. I don't know why. Let's see. We got a Stego here. I was calling the Stego chunky earlier. I think this right here is the chunky boy. Um, yeah, still a little bit uh, shorter than the Stego, um, but yeah, just like so much more fierce looking. Holy crap. All right, let's... Let's try this then. Okay, so that's left click. That does like terrible damage. Right click. Uh, you know what? Actually, we got it. We got to bear in mind we're hitting a stego, so that means that the damage is halved anyway. So yeah, I don't know how to make them bleed. How does that work? Uh, okay, that was like a tail uh, smack, I suppose. Let's see. Come on, bro. Let me get you. We can't pull out weapons on the back, can we? Oh, we can. Oh, that's nice actually. I like that. Let's see. Okay, come on. Let me get this one dude. Oh, why am I fighting Stagos? Oh, crap. Here comes the other one. <laughs> oh, no. Why do I fight Stagos? This is the worst idea. 
<laughs> Especially when you don't deal that much damage. Just like fighting something like this is just not a good idea. It just takes forever. Oh man. All right. So we're basically, I don't know if those guys are made boosted. I don't think that they were at the start. So we're basically doing 140 uh, damage to normal creatures because obviously it's half when you hit Stegos. Let's see. Come on, bro. Let me get you. All right. Come on. Couple more. There we go. Nice. All right. Let me see. Is there anything else around here? There's definitely wolves, but I'm not sure if I should really go after those guys because, I mean, they've already messed up so many of my other creatures and I don't want them to ruin my brand new tame. So, yeah, let's see. Do we have maybe something in the swampy kind of area? What is that over there? Dodix? I think so. What is that right there? That is one wolf. Okay, I'll fight that. So, wait, what do we have then? We got C, which is like a tail smack. X does nothing. Control does nothing. So, left click, right click, and then C. I got to try out that little tail smack though see we got uh oh yeah we got a couple wolves here we should be okay though all right let me let me get right up in their faces okay yeah they've got their pack thingy going as well right now unfortunately oh did i pick him up oh i think i might have <gasps> Ooh, that's good wait oh i can just keep him on my tail no i guess not wait hang on how does that work okay and then oh yeah he just stays on there so kind of just like a normal stego then i guess but if i just keep spamming my attacks he seems to drop off immediately but that also made him bleed so yeah anything that i can kind of impale on my on my spikes pretty much just gets uh the the bleed damage going and everything like that uh let me actually get over here i want to hit this dude with my tail smack do we have a couple of these guys around here yeah we do Ooh, man all right let me see boom okay not so bad uh we're getting pooped on that's okay <laughs> <laughs> it's got some good knockback as well actually so if you got something behind you this is like the perfect thing to use nice all right let me turn around a little bit and actually get them with some of these i'm not sure if we'll be able to impale them with this i would imagine it's probably only like small creatures just like normal entros um come on bro we get you eh. come on Ugh, dude there's too many of them this is a bad idea <laughs> oh no come on Mm, yeah there's this is uh are they throwing snow now what the hell you went from poop to snow where the hell do you even find snow oh my god is i hope that's snow i really hope that's snow because yeah um let's not go there <laughs> all right come on come on let me kill you die please yeah i'm up for you guys dude i'm not able to hit them as well they've got some good knockback on them i hate it all right maybe i should uh yeah, I'm gonna pull out my shotgun, just reload it. I should be able to blast one of them to, um, to, you know, a different universe. There we go. <laughs> Come on. All right, let me turn around. Get a little. Oh, is that a wolf? Okay, crap. All right, yeah, this is bad. There's some bad creatures around here. Okay, are we good? Let me just keep backing up. <laughs> the wolf is gonna kill that dude instead. Oh, man. Come on. Ugh, dude, the poop is so annoying. All right, let me get you. Come here, bro. Dude, like, fight me or don't. Like, you're, you're just flip-flopping between me and that wolf. Like, who do you love? You have to choose. Oh, man. Just being able to, like, grab the wolves like that is hilarious. <laughs> I'm just, like, dropping him from one side to the other. That's great. Come on. Oh, dude. Yeah. Oh, the chalice are just... No. I, I shouldn't have fought this thing. You let me kill you, please. You just die. <laughs> Come on. Let me get you. Let me get you, please. Ah. Come on. Yay, got him, finally. It's not even a good level. It's just like they've got good knockback. They're able to knock me back far enough that it just, you know, it makes it awkward. Um, Actually, you know what? Let me see. Are we safe? It seems like we are. Let me quickly check out your actual base stats. Did we get a good one? Um, Health is relatively good. Uh, I mean, the rest is average, realistically. It's got really good food. <laughs> it's not useful at all. That's all good. Honestly, I wouldn't mind actually getting some of these guys, Uh, you know, maybe... Maybe bread up. Maybe having a really, really good one that we can use would be great. Let's see. Any good level Dodics here? Probably not. You know what? I don't I don't want to tame a Dodic. They are dead to me. Yeah. Oh, that's 180. Although it's hurt, so I don't even want to attempt that right now. Although, I guess... Let me check. I don't know. Maybe I'll be able to knock it out beforehand. No, it's going to ball up super soon. It's all good. I'm just going to leave it. I know I could trap it and everything, but it, it's all good. I'm sure we'll find a different one. <laughs> He's just fully impaled. Look at that. Oh my god. That's definitely at least a kidney gone. What do we got around here? Denonicus attacking Parasaurs. Or is the Parasaurs attacking Denonicus? It's 
kind of looks like there's a whole scooby-doo chase scene going on right here like it was a parasaur chasing a denonicus being chased by a denonicus you know kind of weird <laughs> all right come on and uh, let me get you oh my god look at that there Zeno. whoa you are cool looking let me see oh it's, it's a decent level but yeah no that thing is cool looking i like it we gotta pop on another glow stick oh no we don't because they're gonna destroy it oh no my guy is when i swing nice yeah sometimes that happens all right let me go ahead and pick up this demonicus sweet we'll just uh can we do this other attack okay we just picked him up again somehow i didn't even i'm not even hitting uh i was hitting left click there not right click so i'm not sure how i actually ended up picking him up again that was weird is there some sort of combo attack that i just did <laughs> I have no idea. Well, you know what? I think I want to actually get out of this area and get back to base. So we're going to need something faster to get back to base on. <laughs> Wait, what the hell? Is that a rock drake? What? Oh, no. What the? Oh, my God. That's not a rock drake. Oh, I thought that was a freaking rock drake. That's um, that's a, a thing from Atlas. I can't remember what they're called. Razor tooth, I think. I don't know what it's called on here, though. Dude, I didn't know they could go invisible. Oh, man. <laughs> dude no way oh that's cool we got to tame one at some point but like that's a bad level um yeah okay let me go ahead and just destroy it it's basically like a rock drake meets a uteranus what does it say uh dryptosaurus he's got drip what did he just do to me disorientate me okay yeah there we go <laughs> damn that was cool i thought that was a rock drake 100 percent because the feathers in the head and everything i just i don't know man that was really strange cool all right well at least we know that they can spawn around here i gotta get me one of those at some point i had no idea they could go invisible oh i see an alpha something i don't know what it is i just see the glow could be a raptor let's see let me get up a little bit higher here if it's an alpha raptor we could try and take it out with the kentro also by the way i'm gonna need a name for the kentro so leave some uh, suggestions down below um is it is it just like in this gap here can i even get that where is it let's see um where are you in the mesh like where are you what is that oh yeah he's just like chilling right there okay well i definitely won't be able to take it out with the kentro but i can probably take it out with a long neck oh wait what that didn't count oh no wait is he properly in the mesh i just can't hit him hang on uh what the hell am i looking at down there <gasps> what oh my god there's just like a tiger down there <laughs> hello oh you're 174 i guess i'll tame you <laughs> well first we need to deal with this though yeah i can't hit him there um hang on maybe like this no okay let me go ahead and just reload that maybe i can hit him from above i have no idea can i actually even hit anything down here there we go oh man that absolutely ruined him come on oh yeah that one didn't count oh, man yeah okay i might not actually be able to hit his head because it looks like it's probably in the mesh over there you know what maybe i can actually do this with the kentro we just have to like drop him down on top of him no we can't fit him in here he's too chunky here we go he should die now there we go um now i need to get to his stuff uh, ooh, oh man i'm bouncing all over the place there wow okay hang, hang on a second is that that is slightly better than my one uh, i've been like slowly like inching my way up in terms of damage on these picks like i went from you know primitive to a ramshackle to uh, an apprentice to you know journeyman then up to mastercraft and now we're back down to journeyman it's kind of insane all right let me see if i can actually manage to hit this dude with darts we'll tame it up look at him like shaking his little paw <laughs> oh you're trying to pretend that you're super hurt i mean i know you're hurt i'm the one shooting you <laughs> all right come on bro you gonna get knocked out maybe i'll get right down to it and just check its torpor because i would imagine it's yeah it should be getting close at least and that is making me bleed a lot. Hmm. Well, let's actually let's light up this area by doing that. I figured that it was probably Torpor running at that point. So, yeah, I guess not. <laughs> Come on, bro. Hey, there we go. Nice. Okay, cool. Well, I guess I'll, uh, I'll get that thing all teamed up. Just got to head back to base to grab some stuff for it. And I got to say, the base is looking very good from here. Looks amazing. I cannot wait to actually have everybody else build their houses. <laughs> I've been kind of waiting on them. Like... Don't pressure them or anything, but like, goddamn, <laughs> I want to show you guys what I have. Oh, man. Although it is giving me more time to like work on the interiors, though, as well. So, yeah, 
Um, cool. All right, let me uh, let me hop down here. All right, well, you know what? I think we're probably going to end off the video here, guys. We have the Kentro. We just need to level it a lot more. And honestly, it's just going to level a lot by just being inside of a cryo ball for like at least a day. So yeah, um, guys, what should we name it? Leave some suggestions down below. And uh, yeah, let me know if you guys know a good spot to find those uh, drip Dryptosauruses. I'm just going to call it a Dryptosaurus because that sounds... It's a lot more fun to say. Um, definitely need to get myself one of those. Did not mean to drop off there. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so let me know all that stuff if you have any idea. And uh, yeah, as always, if you enjoyed the video, go ahead, do me a favor, hit the like button. If you want to see more like this, you can, of course, subscribe. And I'll be seeing you in the next one.